Hello, I'm Ethan Thompson, and this is episode 5, part 1 of Mind Tricking. I'm alone on the game. This is the last appearance ever of the USS Roddenberry. It's been a while since I made an episode, episode 2, I mean episode 5, part 2, I'll show you the new USS Waddenbury NCC-01 app, with my first officer, Commander Dean MacDonald, and my communications officer, Sub-Lieutenant Alicia Nee. Join you around the ship for the very last time. Funny memories on this ship. I remember when it was just a chiselled stone brick shell. Sorry, I'm just kicking my crew members, but you will see them later on. I love this ship so much. Been a good run. It's been a sexy ship. The new USS Roddenberry here is Excelsior class, but it is getting changed due to some design faults on the warp missiles. I may even make it into Kelvin type. Should we go? Let's look inside this ship. Mine trek shuttlecraft cockpit. Right, so Mine trek shuttle pod one. The warp core that enables the ship to function perfectly at warp speed. All the people that have watched my videos, I love you. Actually do. Because just that people are putting effort to watch my videos is makes me happy. It's nice that you're doing a nice thing for someone else, to make someone else happy. It's kind. What another song on? Thanks for all the views. I know I've recently got a dislike on one of my, four dislikes on one of my videos. I'm gonna try and swear less on my videos and be more funny, like potatoes and, and a shovel. So you have seen me through thick and thin on this ship. This is where Alicia used to sit. That's where Dylan used to sit. Where Olive used to stand.
I used to look outside this view screen. Look boldly onto the final frontier. Looking at the stars and thinking, we're going to venture out to the stars. We're going to make something of ourselves and be explorers like the great James T. Kerr. The great Commander Spock, McCoy, Scotty, Sulu, Chekhov. And I'm thinking how brilliant it would be to venture outside the solar system and just boldly go off into the horizon. Star Trek and Minecraft are two art forms, but to combine the two is an, the ultimate achievement. This ship, for me, was the ultimate achievement. I love this ship so much. It's sad to see it go. There it comes. The ship will go. USS Roddenberry NCC 01. Constitution class. Let's do some final modifications to this one scratch ship. I've enjoyed this ship. So many fun times. Some not so fun times. I can look back a month ago and look at the first ever episode. I'm thinking, look how shit my ship looks. But now, it looks quite good. Fantastic. Just wait till you see the USS Broddenberry here. You won't be able to contain your excitement because it is such a great ship. Ten. Well, I'd say even twenty times better than this. A lot better. People, my good friends I mentioned, Colin Wallace, Forum Union, Forum Colin, subscribe to him on YouTube. Good friend, good Xbox Live player. I'm
to do with the ship. And I had nowhere else to turn. I came here and built on the ship. The USS Roddenberry, NCC-01. Left behind a great legacy like the once great Gene Roddenberry did. Who the ship is named after. Please don't dislike this video. I haven't sworn once. Now I'm going to recite a great line from Star Trek in memory of this ship because it deserves great send off space the final frontier these are the voyages of the USS Roddenberry its mission to explore strange new worlds to seek out new life forms and new civilizations to boldly go where no one has gone before I'm Ethan Thompson, and this is it, last appearance of the USS Roddenberry NCC-01. Tune in for episode 5, part 2 soon. Live long and prosper.